zero. And uh, today we're gonna start another mission and find a hidden base like this. Let's see. Yeah, definitely. We received information that there's a hidden base of the enemy somewhere in the desert, and that they are holding reploids in it. We have been trying to locate it, but if there's a hidden base and if reploids are being held there, we must save them as soon as possible. Will you help find where the hidden base is? It must be somewhere in the desert. We accept? Yeah, but how did you know where it is? Yes. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we're in the desert. Third time. In this game. So you gotta knock these things down. Not really, but not yet, but um, if you don't wanna get hit by those guys. I mean they're in the original Mega Man game, so they're like they will rush towards you if you're on the same level as them. And those spikes will kill you. So um now you actually do have to um, get down these pillars. Now we're on ice, so you will slip, and these turtle guys are pretty easy. I should go here. And just go to the ladder. I don't know, I felt like exploring, but um, I don't think there's anything over here, so I'm just gonna head back. So yeah, go back over here. And uh, just climb the ladder. There are bombs, and I just ran into one. Very obviously. I don't know. Alright, on here. Anyway. This is a hidden base. Wait a minute. I'll, and I'll unlock the door for you. It's unlocked. Stay alert. Stay alert. Anyway. Now we're in here, and we need to save some. Get to save some little reploid resistance members. Just hit the hit the control thing. And the thing will unlock and sell, which is quite odd since you're hitting it randomly. Anyway, so just go from, from every floor. Uh, don't don't go up until you're sure you've found each one. And, um, yeah, we'll just say thank you and please help the others, and they'll leave. There are seven of them, I believe. Two. I wonder where this door leads to. I can't open it now because it's too well protected. Alright. So, that was fine. And, uh, these green guys. You want to destroy them? Because <laughs> they will alert the base and guards will be called. So, you don't want to get seen. It won't matter if you start hitting them. Uh, you don't want- you can see that. Not like you're gonna get trapped by that. But just... Don't open the cells with the robots in it. Or, I mean, technically they're all robots. Mavericks in it. <coughs> and you'll be fine. Just continue on. Don't get caught. Or else the alarm will go off. And, uh, you'll be good. Alright, you gotta be, you gotta kind of Uh, yeah, I kind of missed those ladders right there. Um, okay, back to the more prisoners to go. And that last prisoner is... Ah, and they got me. Uh, yeah, they found me. Yes, I'm alright, too. Uh, so yeah, you'll just want to wait up here. Some big 
blue guys will come out. I have nice big. Okay, then come out. Don't catch me. Okay. So they're not up there. I realize. And then I realize that they're not over there. So I was quite confused at the time because I did not see those other ladders at all. Okay. Spray, her hair is blue, strangely, and in her talking spray, it's red. So, that's not weird at all. And here we are, approaching the boss. Of course, a boss is protecting it. Wait a minute. Anyway, anyway. Now we're in here. Look zero. That's, that's all. Okay. You must be zero. You have done well to make it this far. But this is where your journey ends. I'm Blizzard Stagroff, the best warrior of Leviathan, the Guardian. You won't beat me. Get ready. <laughs> okay, sorry. Um, anyway, anyway. anyway. It's pretty simple, this guy. I just want to watch out for his... When you hear him yell, he's gonna jump for you. I'm not sure what that stuff in the back of is. Uh, you do not want to use the Thunder Chip as I was at the time, because it was really not gonna help you at all. It's actually gonna get harder than it fairly damages him. the thunder chip and um yeah just unequip the thunder and this boss fight will be a lot easier and faster I think I realized it by now There's the ice chip floating above there. This is zero. I'm returning to the base with the prisoners. Alright. Roger, and don't forget to bring the ice chip. I look forward to your return, zero. Alright, just gotta grab this thing. And now we can use ice attacks. And we are a codename warrior. That's nice. So. Zero, thanks to you, we saved as many as seven rebel lights. Uh, uh, well. Doo -doo. Substitute energy. I'm not sure what that is. Um, 
the substitute energy. But anyway. Anyway, anyway. Okay, seals are just talking about. We're gonna move it once everything's good. But um yeah, that makes sense. Level C. It's okay. Anyway, we'll be right back. I'm gonna take a short break. Because I don't like commentating for this one. And, uh, yeah, see you in a minute. I'm back. Um, oh, uh, sorry about my, um, my window size. It might look weird. Should be fine, though. But anyway, we are back in action. And, uh, let's go. We are today, or er, now, I guess it's the same day. We are returning to our. where me and Seal first met. Or me, Seal and Zero. And we are getting some intel that was originally supposed to be brought back to the resistance base by Seal, but, um, now we have to do it. Because they failed, as you saw in the beginning mission. If you need to catch it up. And uh, a few things changed around here. So first off, there's these things. There's this bomb up here you don't want to touch. More floating grenades waiting to be touched upon. I saw that little extra life up there. I know. Watch out for these guys. If you hit them with a full charge electric shot, then you will be, it will, you'll be stunned, and they will be stunned, sorry, and you'll have a time to get a few more shots. Um, yeah, it's pretty much the same, you just take it slow, because there are a few more enemies, especially these ones get really annoying. Um, Uh, so, this is gonna be a very fast part here, and, yeah, <laughs> uh, these little tank dudes are pretty annoying, dudes, right? um, and <laughs> they knocked me back quite a bit over here, almost died to them. Okay, I don't know why I went back here, because I knew that that, um, that guy would respawn. I was just looking for extra health points, but I knew I would lose it again, so... I don't know. And he's back. And then to do the same process over again. Only faster. Alright, here we are. Almost at the end. There's a massive energy reading ahead. Stay alert. Alright, you're always alert. Not really. I'm not sure what this guy's been to, but I'm just equipping the electric chip because it seems to work on everybody who's not ice. And his name is Ma... Ma... Maha Ganshanshanf... something. Whatever. I'm just gonna destroy him. <laughs> he asked that me that like it's a question, which is quite strange. Because he knows what the thing is, and he knows that he's going to die in a few seconds, or a minute, because he kills me, in a few seconds, unfortunately, how could I die to this, this, this elephant thing? Yeah, to survive that spinning thing, I don't think dash jumping works. You have to regular jump over it. But we're back. Thank goodness we had that extra life. And, uh... These patterns are pretty easy. Just charge up, and he does this. He's gonna throw himself at the wall, so prepare to dash on him. And yeah, the, I guess the electric chip does take up quite a bit of damage from him. And I'll stun him for a second. Charge, jump, attack, and there! We 
simple pattern. And, uh, we got him. It seems. And there's a cyber elf. I, I believe there's one over here, but I don't know. The self-destruct system has been activated, Zero. You have to evacuate now. Uh, yeah. Uh, if you stay there, you will be crushed by... Um, yeah, those, those falling ceiling. But, uh, fortunately there are no more enemies to mess you up. And you can just run around here. But those doors are gonna close on you, so watch out. Should be pretty easy with your dash thing button. the recording temporarily, but yeah, I couldn't reach it. Um, I'll get it in a little bit. I know there's this new, new weapon we can get at base after this mission. Here we are. Turn to base. Alright, let's get that weapon. The rest of the body parts, I guess. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Alright, that's two down. Um, more. I, I assume it's the top part, because that's the one throwing all the grenades. Or whatever they are. So just, I guess, hit that. I guess. I am guessing right now. This should be an easy one. Alright, there we go. Um, I guess that's how you beat him. You drop a cyber off? Okay, cool. Mission accomplished. Good work. Uh -huh. There we go. Oh, that was that was really close. Um, that, we we came close to that. All right, we got our cyber elf. I did not expect that to happen. 
I guess I'm a rank C. That's okay. And, uh... Okay. We just saved Resistance Base. I'm not sure what would happen if, um, we didn't. But we did. So... I'm gonna go get that weapon from Sweet. Zero, you're just in time. Look at this! It's a weapon called the Triple Rod. You can attack in any of the eight directions. It requires technique, but you'll be able to handle it. Alright, let's do this. Let's equip it first. And, uh, I guess we have to level this thing up, too. No, I, I need to talk to you. Okay. Up, down, left. Up. All, all directions, I guess. How about, how about downward? Alright. This thing's pretty cool. Alright, I guess we'll just end the video here. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Peace and sheep.